Alexa, turn smart socket on. Okay. Alexa, turn smart socket off. Okay. Okay, Google, turn smart socket on. Sure, turning the smart socket on. Hey, Google, turn smart socket off. You got it, turning off the smart socket. Hi, everyone. In this video, I'll be setting up this mini Wi-Fi smart plug with Alexa and Google Home. Uh, this is not a paid endorsement, but I was provided this item for free. So let's get started. I'm going to start with a quick unboxing. Now, this box is pretty uh, nondescript as to what it was, but it, it does say mini smart plug, Wi-Fi enabled, Google Home and Amazon Alexa and open it up and here is our smart plug our mini smart plug this will only take up one outlet and then we've got some instructions in here and uh, we'll get this set up in a minute let's get started i've plugged in my lamp right here uh, into a power strip into the device and i can control with this button on the side i can control the on and off of my light so i'm going to go ahead and turn it on right now and I'm going to scan the QR code that it came with right here. Scan and I'm going to open the link. And I hit the download button in a previously and it started downloading an APK. I don't think that's correct. Uh, so I do believe that you need to go to the Play Store and search for Smart Life, Smart Living app and then and download and install that app. I've already downloaded and installed that app, so I'm going to go right into adding devices. And let's see if it can find my device. Confirm, light rapidly and blink. Confirm the Wi-Fi password. And let's see if it connects. 100%, successfully added devices. All right, excellent. It says Smart Socket is the name of this. You can share with family or you can hit done. I'm gonna hit done. Socket is off. Let's see if I can get this to work. Okay, socket is off. Socket is on. On. Ah, oh, look at that. Okay, and you can do a countdown. You can do a timer. You can do make it as a switch. Countdown. You can say oh, I want it on for 15 minutes, or you can just do a timer and add it to a schedule. All right, so that's pretty cool. Uh, but you know, the question is, hey, does this work with Amazon Alexa? Does this work with Google Home? So let's check that out now. So I'm gonna go into my Amazon Alexa app right here. And I'm gonna go into skills and I'm gonna search for the same name of this of the app I downloaded. So I downloaded an app called called Smart Life. Oh, and here it is. I'm gonna select Smart Life. And I'm gonna hit enable. And I'm gonna log in with the login I created when I enabled this app, created my account on this app. Authorize. To continue, close this window. And I would like to discover devices. And now it's discovering devices. Uh, and it found my device. Actually, it found eight devices. I don't think that's correct, but let's see. I did find the smart socket, which is what this is. It's a smart socket. That was the default name. I kept the default name. You're welcome to change it, of course. So I'm going to tap to control it. The plug is on. Now the plug is off. Plug is on. Plug is off. Okay, so now let's control it with the Amazon Alexa. So I'm going to say, Alexa, turn smart socket on. Okay. Alexa, turn smart socket off. Ah, there we go. All right, so now we've got it working with the, uh, with the Alexa. And next, let's go to Google Home. So I'm gonna go to my Google Home app right here. And I'm gonna hit the menu button. I'm gonna hit Home Control. I'm gonna hit Add a Device, the plus button in the bottom right-hand corner. And I'm gonna search for Smart Live Smart Home. And let's, and I see it right here, Smart Life. It's like that. Now I'm gonna have to log in again. All right, I'm gonna click link now. I'm going to authorize. 
and I'm linking my Smart Life account. And here it is. I see it on, and I'm gonna add it to a room. I'm gonna add it to my living room right here. Done. And I'm all set. So now I can say, okay, Google, turn on the smart socket. Sure, turning on the smart socket. Okay, Google, turn off smart socket. Sure, turning the smart socket off. And voila, here we go. And so I've successfully set up the uh, smart socket on both Google Home and Alexa. Thanks for watching and please subscribe and join me next time. Bye.